All right, girls, we are going to learn the Fibonacci sequence. There you go, Hope. This is our first variable. We're going to write a computer program right here to do it. There's our three variables. We've got Fibonacci 1, Fibonacci 2, and Fibonacci 3, our three Fibonacci variables. So someone tell me. Actually, you tell me. What's the very first number in the Fibonacci sequence? Zero. Oh, zero. What's the second number One. in the Fibonacci sequence? Hold it really tight so I can draw on it. There we go. Okay. So, Molly, help me. How do we come up with the third number in the Fibonacci sequence? You add zero and one seven. You do it. So do it for me. Okay. Awesome. So we've got zero plus one is one. Come on up. What do we have to do next with these numbers? What are we going to do with Hope's number? There we go. And tell us what you're doing. So you threw away whatever was in Hope's. One plus one. One plus one is? Easy stuff. Who's my next computer programmer? Jackie. Tell Hope what to do. What's Hope going to do with her number? <laughs> Kaylin, you're our next computer programmer. We need to calculate the next number in the Fibonacci sequence. Thank you, Kaylin. <laughs> Okay, wait, um, you guys are just variables. You have to wait for the computer programmer to tell you what to do. Okay. You can't just do it. Variables um, don't think on their own. We threw hopes <laughs> away. Yeah, okay. And um, um, we moved um, the variable that was there to him. Okay. And so 3 plus 2 is 5. Okay, who's my next computer programmer? Come on up, Jenny. <laughs> So explain what you're doing when you do it, and tell the variables what to do. They don't know what to do. They're just variables. It's up to the computer programmer to tell them what to do. Um, so you need to get rid of your 2, and you need to pass away your 3, and then you need to pass away your 5. And then, now you are 8. And how did you come up with that 8? You just add those two numbers together. Okay. So tell them what to do. You're the computer programmer. Get rid of the 3, move the 5, move the 8, and we add them together, and 13. Okay. Hi, Mom! So that's how you can write a computer <laughs> program. Hi, welcome to Grade 7 Technology. This is Molly and Sophia, and they're going to be doing the Fibonacci sequence on Scratch. Hi. Okay. okay. So what's happening? Well, it can't. So it goes from zero to one, then one again, and then because what it's doing is it's adding the first number, like uh, plus the one before, and then you, it would equal what that number would. Be. Okay, so if the first two numbers were zero and one, what would the third one be? Two, one. Sorry. And then one after that would be two. Okay. All right. So how does your computer program work? Molly. Okay, so first we put when flag clicked and you set, well, you have to make variables, Fib 1, Fib 2, and Fib 3. Which stands for Fibonacci 1, 2, and 3. Yeah. And then you first you set Fib 1 to 0. Okay. And that makes it 0. And then you set Fib 2 to 1, and that's the second number. Okay. Fib 2. So it's basically adding the first and second number. Okay. Okay. So then what does your code do after that? So what's going on here? What's this next line? It repeats it 10 times. Okay. So what does that mean? If it repeats it 10 times, it's going to print out how many of the sequence? 10. Yeah. Okay. All right. So what happens next? This is where it gets a little complicated, right? So what's happening here? After what you have to do is after you repeat, you have to make it so that the fib, the Fibonacci one goes to two, and then the Fibonacci two goes to three. Okay, so you're like bumping them down yeah. the line? Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay, and how did, the one part you didn't, I don't think you explained is what's happening, how do we determine what Fibonacci three equals? Oh, would you like to say Molly? Um, I'll try. It's um, Fib one plus Fib two, so that's, that would be the first number plus the second number. Yeah. Okay. And so Fibonacci 3 would be the answer to one, the first number and the second number. All right, so let's run this. Show me how it works. Okay. Ooh, okay. So it goes to 
Zero. No. Tell me, tell me, and do the math at the same time. Two, and then because two, two plus one, one three, and then three plus two is five. Five plus three Ooh. is eight. Eight plus five is thirteen. <laughs> and then, um, okay. 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 All right. Speeding up. All right. Awesome. Thanks very much, guys. Oh.